I think that the increased armament of Ukraine is only going to make the war last much longer. And so I think in this sense it's a tragedy. And who is losing the most from this increased armament are Ukrainian people. I think that there have been opportunities over the past 18 months for peace talks. And I think that that's the avenue that should be pursued. But instead the United States has heavily pushed behind the scenes Ukraine to not approach peace talks. Because the United States has an interest in the conflict continuing. A lot of these countries from the global south that you have mentioned are understanding very clearly that it's very dangerous for the purpose of global peace and prosperity to allow one country to impose sanctions on another. The position of these countries that have not wanted to respect the sanctions has a lot to do with the idea that they consider this kind of unilateral order in which the United States has the ability to impose these kinds of illegal sanctions as something that is, that is uh, prejudicial to the entire world. I don't think that it in any way serves the purpose of promoting peace. I don't think that it provides a context of security for countries in Asia because this eastward expansion into Japan, which again does not in any way serve the interests of Japanese people, does not serve the interests of other countries in the region, is only going to propagate war.